I looked up pickups from Fender. I'm like, what are these uh, 64 Telecaster Pure Vintage? That sounds cool. I'm like, I don't know. I don't know. Pickups are pickups, right? Apparently not, because uh, yeah, I proved that because I didn't like the other ones. I saw the uh, the output EQ. I'm like, that's what I want. I want something warm. I want something that sounds a little bit different, but I want it to be traditional telly. And uh, that's what I got. So I'm going to rewire it again. That's why I mentioned I'm going to be showing stuff a couple times. So there is a, a pickup mod that you need to do on your neck pickup if you're doing a four-way wiring. And the best way to describe it is, I'm going to show it here, but see that little wire that's kind of looping over there? That is a grounding wire that's grounding the top uh, metal plate on the outside of a pickup. And eventually it's going to look like that. So basically you're cutting that wire, you're replacing it with a full uh, long cable, the yellow one there. And that yellow cable has to go to the control, the controls. So you're grounding it in a different spot. Basically your ground is moving. So that's, uh, I'm going to show exactly how I do it here because if anybody's interested, maybe you came to this video just to find out how to do a, a four-way mod on your neck pickup. So there you go close up so that's like a little wire and I'm basically replacing it so what is it connecting to you see I'm cutting the I'm cutting it there it's connecting to uh, a little piece of the metal that's pushing through like you see there's two tabs there's a third tab and that's the third tab coming through it's connected to that and that grounds it you're grounded go to your room does anybody ground people anymore is that even a thing you ever get grounded when you're a kid here we go Helping hands. I highly recommend one of these if you're ever doing any soldering. And this was supposed to be a solderless job, right? Technically it is. Uh, if I had, certain pickups are wired for this already, right? Some, some pickups have three wires. In this case it didn't, so. I'm no expert on soldering, but I, I can, you know, I can work my way around. So I was just uh, doing it there. It's kind of fun. It's, it's relaxing. And uh, there we go. That's all you gotta do, a little bit of solder. Don't blow on it. Apparently that's bad for it. I don't know why, but people have said that in the past. There we go. We've got a solid connection. You just let it cool. It's really neat. It's kind of like uh, if you ever work with hot glue gun. It's like that. But Oh, here's a tip that somebody told me. They said, tape your strings when you're going to pull them off. And that actually leads to another one of those shorts I did. I did one of those vintage, uh, talking about vintage tuners and, and why they're the best. And that's why you can take the strings off like that. So I put the tape on there try that out so to avoid everything from getting all the strings getting wrapped together which is a really big pain when you're putting them back on so okay so like I mentioned we're taking off everything we're taking out the, the pickups and we're gonna be replacing them with this set which uh, I'm really excited to hear and yeah, there you go that's for you ASMR fans and putting in the pick guard uh, sorry putting in the pickup into the pick guard I'm just kind of setting the height height to what I like there and then you can always adjust it later all right here we go how many times is this now third time I'm taking the bridge off fourth time that can't be good for the screw holes I'm just wearing away that poplar wood and it's not a solid wood it's like a, a soft wood there you go here's a comparison they look pretty close I don't know something going on now that the, the uh, you can see the board is like this gray kind of stuff I don't know what that is if you, if you guys know in the description what these materials are um, let me know. Otherwise, the uh, the pickup looks pretty close, but it does not sound the same at all. I'll tell you that from from experience later on playing it. It's it's awesome. I love this this '64 vintage kit, uh, or sorry, pickup set. It's not a kit. Here we go. I told you I was going to show you how to do the wiring, and this is going to be yeah a little bit fast. You just use a little. There's little pull tabs, and you push down. I'm speeding through it here, but honestly, two and a half minutes. They have like a little, they have a little uh, book with the instructions, on how to wire your guitar, which is awesome. You really can't screw it up unless you screw up the wiring on that neck pickup mod, which I did the first time. I screwed it up the first time. I didn't show it, but I couldn't figure out what I was doing. I didn't understand about the, the ground wire and having to move it to a certain spot. But now I do. Hopefully that makes sense to you. Just finishing up here, putting everything back together. We're almost done here. 